Hello, and welcome back. <laughs> so we've got another special episode for you all with Greg and Paul once again. <laughs> We've Episode. all just been eating some crisps. Everyone's going, yeah. like, getting the crisps getting out the of their teeth. Yeah. So we thought we would do a bit of a special episode with a Ask Us Anything because we get so many questions yeah. all the time asking what Paul and Greg think of things. So we thought we'd do one involving them. We've got some really good questions. So should we yeah, should let's I kick start. it off? Right. So wait a minute, this is people asking you stuff. Yes, so on our Instagram, people DM us or we do like a questionnaire on the Instagram and people put in their questions. Because they can ask you anything. Yeah, anything. <laughs> <laughs> we know. <laughs> right, okay. <clears throat> what causes the most arguments in your relationships? Whoops. <laughs> should we go in? Oh, here we go. go. <laughs> here we go. Um, I think with me and Greg, sometimes it, it's like really silly bickering stuff, isn't it? Like, not not competition with each no. other. Well, I, I've cooked the dinner, I think yours, so can you yours go two is trips. Yeah, yeah. Trips, oh, yeah, and yeah, a few yeah, trips yeah. here and there. Yeah. I think Greg should be allowed a few more trips, though. Oh, yeah. Sh- yeah. He, he, uh, sorry, I'm speechless. Paul, He's had... There would have been murders. <laughs> there would have been murders. But when Billy goes out, yeah, yeah. Oh, shush, 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 shush. It is, is too. With, with me and Billy, right, let's not. Let's no, no. It's let's one not more another rule for me. No, no. That's you actually, go out coming at four or five in the no, morning. No, actually, your so double that's, standards. No, that's your. That's your. Your double standards. Though. Actually, that's that's one. I know when to go home. Greg, Greg has double standards anyway. Right. I know when to go home. You okay. Don't. So, right, just quit. Uh, let me just say what our, mine and Paul's I is. I think ours is who slept the most. Ah, yeah, yeah. Right, we. The only That's the only thing we really saw. It's of. literally like, well, I've had more sleep than you. No, you haven't. Like, so we'll go through like the week of who's had what sleep, who's had Edward, yeah. who's been up in the night. And then when he was in Dubai recently for two weeks, let me just um put that out there. Oh, two weeks. I want to ask you about that, Paul. Um How did you get I had that? all of them with sickness bug at home. Oh, I remember, that went on for yeah. a whole week. Obviously I had mum on the weekends, but that I will not let go. Yeah, because you had a sickness yeah, bug. Like, other than that. No sleep. It is it is that's we we but I was I was gonna say not so much with the sleep thing anymore because obviously Margot's mm. sleeping. Yeah. But we it is that sort of like competition thing sometimes. Yeah. Well, you know I've come home cooked dinner and you can't even, you can't clear or can you bath the baby tonight while I'm clearing up? It's that sort yeah. of like getting that balance sometimes, isn't it? Of who does what? Yeah. yeah and sleep no sleep deprivation. Sleep is sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Really sleep, hard. sleep yeah. is you, if you're not sleeping. It is, yeah. Oh, yeah. and you just uh, you just hate each other. But I sleep with Edward most of the time, so. No, he does. It's not it's not sleeping with Edward. It's getting Edward to sleep. It takes mm. hours. No, the other night, I sleep with him. On a Monday night, he goes. Well, even goes, now, still, yeah. It takes yeah. so long to get asleep. Yeah. And he tosses and turns all through the night, so he wakes up constantly. So then mm. you've got both broken sleep. Well, yeah, anything, well anything do you know what? And I've got, I've it's actually well got him it. a cot in his life. room. But anything he's just being that life. persistent, isn't it? and it's probably hard, a little bit harder now where he's a bit older. Yeah, he's but way you, more it's that thing of like you we have had, to go for a few nights. Two of, nights of Annie the nanny. Yeah, and it's changed our life. We sleep. We, Margot goes but down Margot seven. Margot was and a wait, lot younger oh, than what Edward. And it's breastfed baby and not breastfed. Yeah, so it is. It's different circumstances. It's worth a try. Well, that changed I, our life, I, didn't it? it I, like... I know that method and I tried it myself yeah. and it worked for a week and then he was back in the bed again. It's <laughs> <Really, laughs> our own fault. Self-inflicted. Why, mm. <laughs> I know, that's the hard thing. Anyway, next question. Ah, this is a good one. What gives, Paul and Greg, this is to you, mm-hmm. what gives you the ick about me and Samantha? The ick. <laughs> the ick. Oh, I can't really say I that. know what you're saying. No, you, you can say about Samantha. <laughs> <you're saying> about <laughs> I, 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 in my head, I think I know exactly what yours is going to be. I have no idea. Um, I know what it is. I don't, I don't know, know what it is. I don't think there's nothing know that it. actually gives me the ick. Ah. Because if it did, I wouldn't have married you. Yeah. For a thing that annoys me about you um, is... When you go out, you say you're going to be home at 10 or 11 and you come at 4 in the morning. Oh. That, that's the thing that annoys me. He's, really really no, 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 he's making out like Billy's a raver. Excuse me, when, when do I even go out? Me. I think it'll be all right. Or, no, but that, what annoys that me. doesn't even happen that often. Come on, when do I even go out? I can't remember the last time I went <laughs> out. out. What do you no, think? With my friends. What do you think my one is about you? Well, it's... Before I say it, do you have anything you're going to say? No, there's nothing that stands out that makes me think. I think it's because you're too tired. So I think it's because think... you um, you leave stuff everywhere. <laughs> I don't. Like if you cut a label off, yeah, there'll be I'll a bin that. there. You'd leave the label there rather than putting the bin. Greg does or that. <laughs> Greg's she would like messy. take no, the I'm toothpaste lid, lid off and just leave it off. Like not put it back yeah, because on. Because you know what? I'm brushing my teeth whilst really? walking around the house doing things. So I can't mm. even just stand and brush my teeth. It's brush your teeth and Edward comes running in. 
she'd open a drawer to get something out and just not close the drawer. So the drawer would just stay open. <laughs> Nelly, like, Nelly you could just pull it open you? and close it. It's yeah. so easy. You do things like that. Yeah. Just on the drawer, on the drawer thing. The drawer I'm phone. usually cooking within my cooking space. No, I mean where in I your need to get access. in your makeup drawers. Don't come in there. I have to. It's, it's not, it's not, not for you to come in my dressing room. That's my right, okay. Go on, what did you think so that one was, though? Sorry, I thought it was going to be when like the gel toenails grow out a bit. Ah. Yeah, I suppose He so. hates it. Really? Yeah. Now he's beds, got, you see that Now beds, now yeah, beds. he hates beds. He always oh, goes really? beds. Yeah, beds. he notices it on everything. Anyone that that's really got a now funny. bed, he'll notice it. Okay. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> you have to go on a day out with the other husband... What are you doing? The Where husband. are you going? Where, would you survive the day? I think me and Greg will probably go and do a skydive. Yeah. Would you? Yeah. I remember, yeah, I remember would you years really? ago. Would you Greg, you you, one, didn't I? No, you, I like, you said, it. let's do it yeah. in Dubai. And I was like, ah, oh, and then we ended up didn't doing it. So I, I think like, me and Greg would do something. I'd give it to you as a birthday present and then they'd give it to you. Yeah. Yeah, you've got the Yeah, I've got the Billy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, you bottled it. There we go. I think me and Paul would have a little mooch around Knightsbridge. Yeah. Go Zoom. Yeah. yeah. A bit We'd have a little yeah, bit of lunch. Yeah. I think me and Greg would do something out. more, like, active. Yeah, something yeah. more. Yeah, Billy's, like, when I, t- I took Billy to, on a date, didn't I, to oh. the balloon thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, here we go again, talking about the balloon museum. And I was like, I've got this all planned, we're going to the balloon thing. I didn't even tell her, actually, but then I ended up giving away a bit of it. We're going, away. Room, we're going here, we're going there, we're staying in the hotel. And she's like, oh, what am I going to wear? <laughs> oh, I've got a, she, she's just moaning No, no, it. but I you said, know what? why are you moaning? You haven't even been there. <laughs> you haven't even been there. Why are you moaning? I stitched myself up as well because I put on these boots. I, d- I didn't think I was going to be doing a lot of walking around. Clearly we was. And I had I got blisters in like the first half an hour of the day. So you oh, know when you're like, yeah, you're no. Stupid, no. Stupid, you're in Fendi boots. And I was like, why are you wearing them? But you know no, what you're wearing. No, that's the worst, well. isn't yeah. it? You need a pair of trainers, yeah. Anyway, next question. Okay. Um, okay, what is one thing you've gotten away with that Sam or Billy never found out? Oh. It's like grassing yourself up. Oh, hey. <laughs> Go on, anything funny? Not on, lads. Oh, don't I'm shaking here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Anything? Come on. You, got that, that you haven't got that. You haven't found that. That's funny. That's funny. Oh, I know. When we first got together, I shit the bed. But remember? I do. But I know about oh. that. Do you remember that? Oh, did I tell you that? But I know about that. Oh, you know about that. Sorry. You told oh, me well, about well, that. Yeah, no, but no. no oh, I think, about, I think I know about about that. from Paul the story. He ate a dodgy uh, crab stick. I've only been with Billy literally right. months. Not and what months. happened? Oh. I got up. Apparently, you know, was it in the middle? No, it must been in, in the, the middle, morning. No, it was in the middle of the night. Was at that stage no, where you're still running off hiding from a fart and all that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I make it up to make a tea or something? Yeah. So that wouldn't have been in the middle of the night. It would have been in the morning. No, 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 no. So basically, what happened? In the middle, I ate some crab sticks in the middle of the night. Bad stomach ache. Got to the toilet. Got back in bed, shit the bed. Yeah, that's fair on there. And then, and then, the bed. And then um, soil. And soil. Soil. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that makes me. So I quickly, I quickly like got some baby wipes or something, clean the poo out the bed. Now I'm lying in. No, no, you know what I mean? It's still stained. No, 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 you have like, took the sheet off. Like, up. <laughs> Do you want a cup of tea? I went, yeah, go on. <laughs> Whip the sheet off. Yeah. Got the new sheet, put the new sheet no, on. I, just, I don't even know how. Bed. But to be fair, I and never noticed. Know. I, no. never, I can't remember if didn't smell it. Never know. Like a year later, I told yeah, you. Yeah, and then you did. He told me like later on down the line. You know when like a table is dressed and it's got the cloth underneath and you pull it out? That's what I would have done with the bed sheet, but I should have still in it. Yeah. You woke up that was But you didn't know about that one. So I don't think there's anything. Well, nothing you can share. What about you? I don't know. Not that. Secretive guys, are we? Secretive guys. Have you ever tried to get Sam and Billy into football? I've never seen a football a football game. What? Do you know that? I've never oh, been it, to a football match game. Ever. Is so much ever. M- it's actually really fun compared to just watching it at home on the telly. We got invited, mm. didn't we, uh, to Chelsea in a box, and she still didn't come. Oh really? She yeah. went, I'll go if I go in the box. If I go, in a, and I went, look, we've been invited, we can go. And you still didn't go, but I, I know, but it might have been there on. was a reason. Yeah. I think the football that I have been to with you, I've really enjoyed. Yeah. Um, but I wouldn't say you want. You, you haven't tried to get me into it. I try to be. I try to be. Um, You're quite enthusiastic. Enthusiastic, about it. so I ask a lot ask of questions. questions but mm. I think over the years now, you're kind of just fed up of answering. Yeah. Like, because yeah. I try, but I have no idea. Really. Yeah, I don't. I'm not really. Oh, I love it when, so when actually. Saying, can, so, I, can I ask you if, when you're watching Saint Indoors together? Does Samantha yeah. constantly go, yeah. Well, yeah. what's going on with this? Yeah. But not football, yeah. like, just could no, be anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Just like, we're watching, 
And I'm, I'm like, like, I'm watching the same thing yeah, you're yeah, watching. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah, know yet. Yeah. Yeah. Why is that with yeah. him and all that? And I go, no, but I've been watching, well, watching it. it. Yeah, yeah. But now it's become something because I know it's annoying him. I go, Oh, yeah, yeah. Robert, where's he come from? Where's he? <laughs> yeah, but Billy will do that to me as well. Like, if we do anything or go anywhere, she'll yeah. ask me questions. Like, oh, I don't know because I haven't seen it or done it or experienced yeah. it, whatever we're talking about. No, it's really, no, that is a thing. Going back to that question, what, like, I'm just interested. Me. But can I just say, going back onto the football thing, sometimes now I've noticed that if anything big happens, like a big transfer, you tell me with excitement. That's quite, like, that's quite, sign yeah, like he'll tell me, yeah, yeah. and I think, ah, so like th- th- it's opened up a bit. We do talk a little bit about yeah, football, brought you in a little bit, brought me in a bit, but oh, but if I done that bit, you think I'm talking Chinese, you don't even know what I'm <laughs> see if you're like, why is it like, why you? right? Next question If Sam and Paul got married, he wasn't gonna get away from this. If Sam and Paul got married, where would your dream stag do be? Paul? Oh, Vegas. 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 Vegas, Vegas, baby, Vegas. Vegas. We've already planned Samantha. We're doing three. Oh my gosh, yeah. you're so extra. You're like Greg. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you are. Done four. <laughs> four. Four, yeah. But I, I done four. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, kids and family life. Some more questions for everybody. Um, who chose each baby name? Well, I think we've got Arthur, a lot to get through. Yeah, Ar- <laughs> yeah. Arthur was sort of because your granddad Arthur, was yeah, called if Arthur. I, if I ever had a boy, it was always going to be Arthur. Nelly, was it you or Mum? No, Mum. Mum that called Nelly, me. Nelly, you, you was going to call her Elsie. Elsie, yeah. 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 And then... Um, then my sister got a dog yeah, called, it called it Elsie. Yeah, called Before I had the baby. <laughs> I was like, great. But also, um, I, I, when when I had her, I didn't... She didn't she look like an Elsie. Yeah. She just didn't... It didn't click. And, and then Mum... Mum name... Mum Nelly. mentioned ne- Nelly, mm. and I was like, oh my gosh, she's Nelly. Yes. I remember bringing you going, she's Nelly. And then with Margot, obviously Margot was our great nan. Yes. And I just said when I was pregnant with her, I, if, if we have it's a little a girl, girl, I'd like to call mm. her Margot. That's a lovely name. Never did. So Paul, you always wanted your th- first son to be Paul, didn't you? Yeah. But you know Paul what, right? Remember for so long he was baby Paul. Baby Paul. Right. I still call him baby Paul yeah. now sometimes. Yeah, so do we. Or little Pauls. Little Paul now, sort but of like, more. I know it's always the same, you think oh, that it couldn't be anything else, but even from the minute little Paul was born, he was always he Paul, was wasn't he? was just a little Paul, yeah. It's really sweet. Baby Paul. Um, Rosie didn't get named for a month, mm. and it was so frustrating because I I think it was always Rosie, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Rosie's it was my cut off. Six weeks. Six weeks. Oh, six weeks. For, to register. So what happens then? Uh, yeah, they just fine you 100 quid or something. I don't know. Are you joking? No. Well, you, yeah. have to, you have to register them, don't you, to get your birth certificate and all that. For your passport, yeah. 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 Um, um, fine. Oh my God. You get a fine. Well, Rose, Rosie was my nan's name. It's my favourite girl's name. So it was no. like it was always and that, mine. but we just ages to the side. Yeah. Well, no, I I, I always said Rosie's like it's just a lovely. And then it was you that was really holding back. Yeah. And then you actually liked another name. I think it was like Florence or something, wasn't it? Was it Florence? It was, I think we had a few names. No, it, you, that, he but... did, and I've got a girl's name that I still really love. And if we was to ever have another baby and it's a girl, like there's this one name mm. that I always really want, but probably not going to have anymore. <laughs> uh-huh. um, and then Freeze Edward enough, yeah. oh, so enough, like. Edward is my favourite boy's name in the whole entire yeah, world I actually did want Edward. little Paul to be Edward but it didn't kind of work out like that so mm. Edward, Edward. He's such a little Edward yeah, as Edward's well a yeah. Edward. Edward yeah it's a lovely name we don't really shorten it occasionally is like when he's being cheeky we call him Eddie don't yeah we? would you yeah little would you Eddie. call him Eddie yeah. oh, no I want him to stay Edward we, we, Edward, we yeah. always call him Edward but sometimes we go come on Eddie when he's when he's at school they might call him Ed you know, yeah, like, I feel like someone's going to call him. Yeah, as unfortunately, as a teenager, they're probably going to call him Eddie or something or mm. Ted. You know, that, that kids we do ne- that, don't they? <laughs> With Nelly, um, Nels. A lot of her I friends and her teacher call her Nels. Really? Yeah. Your, yeah. your dad calls her Nels. I don't yeah. like that. Yeah. I like Nelly. Yeah. I love yeah. Nelly, but you can't help it, can you? No. It's like just, me, Sam. Yeah, I mean, I never, I've never called you Sam. No, I've always called Samantha. 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 Ma'am, I never, yeah, I couldn't, Sam. Yeah, it doesn't sound right. Samantha's a bit of a mad abbreviation. Ma'am. Yeah, it is. Well, yeah, it's because it's Samantha. Just call her Sam. yeah. Yeah. No, but you, Sam. You're a... one of the very few people that call me Samantha. Yeah, yeah. He calls, yeah he's call, always said that. You've yeah. always yeah. called me yeah. it. I prefer, you call me Sam, you'd never call Sam. me Samantha. Yeah, say it, say it. it's funny, Samantha. isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who gave Susie the best first impression? Probably Paul. Really? <laughs> oh yeah, Jesus, bloody hell, I wasn't like... Yeah, you wasn't exactly... I was a, I was a black sheep of the family. You wasn't exactly oh, so oh, yeah. yeah. yeah, got to get <laughs> out. Oh, we won't go into God. that. <laughs> Jesus. Didn't make the best uh, nah. first impression. Was the first time, 
I'm trying to think, when did you first meet mum? Oh, actually, I just got a flashback and I think I know what it is. Go on. I can't say. What do you mean you can't say? It was at mum's and mum was there. Yeah, there was a few of you. Yeah, Yeah. it was like a... Like a little little kitchen party. Christmassy sort of time. Yeah, it was. A little Susie soiree. Soiree, yeah. Yeah, Susie needs to have some more soirees. She ain't been having no soirees. She doesn't have anyone around the new house. But she's waiting for her carpet to be done and then she's going to... (laughs) <laughs> to host some things right okay who between Greg and Paul would win the Eliminator event in Gladiators what's Eliminator <laughs> is that the thing at the we'll end we'll let you answer no, that you lads you know that have you, you watched it uh, have you watched it the new one oh it's the same is as the old same one is it same as the old one yeah same yeah, yeah, as the yeah. old one yeah I don't Paul's know Paul's I know it like depends the back if of my Paul's hand. in training or not I yeah, don't know I'll... No, Paul's fast though Remember, in Vegas, you beat me in a race if I let you in. But, yeah. Yeah. Um, no, Paul is quite fast. No one realises they think because yeah. I'm big, I'm Although not fast. he's quite big, like he actually can run. You, no, he's yeah. fast, he's quick. Yeah. Just a little step. I don't know, I'd say maybe it depends if I'm in training or not. <laughs> depends what your balance is like. Yeah. Why don't we just depends do it? In, in I'm quite heavy, so the hanging, I might struggle yeah. out. Depends if, if you're training. Like that a big time. hanging piece of meat. Yeah. Big <laughs> slab of palm Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, can you do that yet? Like, you know, like you can do Beat the Wall. What's it called? Um, mm. Like the Ninja Warriors. Sort Ninja of thing, Warriors, yeah. yeah. They haven't. I bet they will. I bet yeah, they'll do that. Yeah. yeah. Do that. Be be when they TV. do, when <laughs> they do, we'll, 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 yeah, we'll get you on there. Um, what didn't you expect about becoming a public figure when you got into a relationship with Sam and Billy? I think it's just the way that people think that or feel that they know you, and obviously yeah. they do because they get a little insight. But it's like that feeling of. Like people come up to me and ask me stuff sometimes. I think like you just would never ask me for that. I mean, yeah. you know what I mean, like, like girls, why aren't you married yet? And I think you like, oh, oh yeah, like, so, yeah. Why would you and say it's that? so awkward. Yeah. Yeah. Like, where do you, do you go with that conversation? Yeah. yeah, yeah, like people could be a bit too familiar, yeah. familiar, yeah. And it makes and it makes you feel a bit uncomfortable. Pictures, I always found pictures a funny one as well. Like people ask for your picture, I think, why do you want a picture of me for? And then I do it and I say thanks to them. Yeah. Thanks, so do I. Thank yeah, you. I, say, thanks, I always say thank you. you. Yeah. yeah. I didn't expect to be on a TV show. That's what I was yeah. going to say. TV we, show. Yeah. Yeah. You probably didn't expect to become public figures yourselves. Yeah. Yeah. Not, not, is in, yeah. Like, not, like, like, not to, like, to actually do stuff that's in, like, similar roles yeah, to what yeah, we're exactly, doing. Yeah. Like, when you're doing your Hello Fresh jobs and your. <laughs> but we did this and also, and also just filming a lot, like, filming a lot. And yeah. Yeah, because Greg often says, he's like, who'd have thought we had, like, when mm. we do things? Right, this is quite funny. Some other questions um, from our listeners. Um, have you ever tasted breast milk? My partner refuses to try mine. I have, haven't I? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Paul loves it. <laughs> I tried it once. How was that? Try it. <laughs> no, he tried, it with, <laughs> he tried it with little Paul, so years ago, and then didn't try it with Rosie and didn't try it with Edward, so you clearly you didn't like it. No, it was like, I don't know. It's, it's really sweet. It's sweet, oh, yeah. yeah. No, have you tried? I feel like no, I didn't. Have I you not tried any no. breast milk? I think I tried some of yours. You had put it in the pot when I was thinking, no, that's weird. <laughs> no, the breast milk lollies. Yeah, imagine. Yeah. <laughs> that one. Um, I remember those. I used um, mumsicles. Mumsicles. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sure we done that filming years we ago. We did years yeah, ago. Yeah, yeah. That was like really yeah. back Frozen in the day. Frozen breast milk. Um, yeah, no, maybe you haven't. You must have tried your own. Mate, tried. Did you tried your own. Didn't I put some in your tea once? No, you put the placenta juice. Placenta juice in my tea, yeah. Yes. Oh, what yeah. the tincture? The tincture, yeah. yeah. It doesn't taste like chocolate. it tastes like vodka, though, doesn't it? Yeah, it does taste really. I didn't even know. It's yeah, alcohol. Yeah. Like. It's basically <clears throat> pure alcohol and your placenta juice. Oh, is it? Yeah. Um. So no one else has tried breast milk apart from me and Paul. Mm. You have, haven't you? Yeah, I've tried. Yeah, it, yeah. it's like really sweet. Yeah. You know, some some women sell their breast milk online and make thousands from it oh because God. bodybuilders, some bodybuilders drink it because it's like so nutritious. Wow. You can buy it. It's just it's <clears> just the thought of drinking. I know this sounds absolutely bizarre because we're but, but you're you're drink you drink a cow's milk. Yeah, yeah. Don't know where it's drink we're a big drinking day on yeah. something <laughs> from someone's a human body. But then I suppose I we're drinking stuff from animals' body. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's in a, like a little but shed. But it's, it's only because we've been made to think that's normal. Yeah, yeah isn't it? That's yeah, why yeah, it's yeah. okay. But obviously, we're made to think it's not normal to drink. Rosie often is like really sort of curious. And I say to her, "No, come on, you don't need to try it." Because she's sometimes she's been like with Edward, like, well, "What does it taste like? Can I try some?" Yeah. And I was like, "I can express some, and you can try it. You yeah. know, <laughs> take it from my yeah. boobs." Yeah. <laughs> she's always been a bit curious. <laughs> 
Like, she obviously doesn't remember. Uh, where do you dream of living when the kids have grown up and moved out? Somewhere oh. sunny. Somewhere. <laughs> I, I said to Greg... We talk about this. Our, yeah, yeah. My, our dream would be to buy somewhere abroad, definitely, to have yeah. like a... Second some, home. Yeah, that we could like go but back not and forth. Like far. Not far, like... like Spain, yeah, 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 like... Yeah, we talk somewhere, about Mallorca a lot, don't we? Yeah, yeah, just somewhere where we could jump on a plane. And also, as the kids get older, imagine how fun, like... Oh, you can go with your friends. You know, like when they're yeah. in the later years. But Dubai, we talk about Dubai a lot, but I think that's just a big thing moving to Dubai. It's all like really big life changing things. Yeah. But if you're fortunate enough to have a holiday home, like Mallorca or that Spain, be a dream. two hours, south yeah, of France, somewhere hours. which is a couple of hours away, <clears throat> that's the dream, isn't it? Mm. Jump on a flight, and then you know, like in the summer holidays when they're older, you can just be there all summer. Yeah. Mm. If you can, like, if you're, you can work from all different. That would be, yeah, we always I say think that. at the minute, though, with their ages, I think we're better off in hotels because the yeah. kids need other kids. Yeah, otherwise it's just nice driving to your be, man otherwise. Yeah, yeah. And like when there's like, stuff for them to do. Different restaurants. Otherwise, yeah. you do feel like you are cooking every night. Yeah, and sometimes a holiday, holiday day. And yeah. then if there's no other kids there, they're, they're just driving yeah. us mad, so. <clears throat> yeah, that is true. It's nice to when you go away to be cooked for, isn't it? Because mm. that's what it's kind of about, isn't Hard it? holiday, yeah. Not I do often think, as well, like when we're older, obviously not now, but... I always think like, what would it be like to live in like a an apartment in right in like central London? Mm. Yeah, not that I would mm. like. That's not really. I wish we done it before. We, kids. Yeah, we, we always it, we, we used to talk about it, but that on that was the days when I was filming for Towie, so I couldn't really be out of Essex because Greg always used to say, "Let's go and rent an apartment for yeah. six months in the West End and live there." And actually, mm. now I suppose it would have been a good thing to do, but mm. at the time I couldn't because of. You you really into you're really in, you'd like to live in London just to London see what pad. it's like. I'm not too fast. So much to do it, as well. It yeah, is, you, you do a fortune though, wouldn't yeah, you? Yeah, you'd be you out if you yeah, like, even if you go in the mountains and like you'd end up you yeah, yeah. spend even a fortune, like but. God. Remember we went into um, obviously you wouldn't be doing this every day at all. Remember me, me and you went into Harrods after your birthday thing and I got us the butter chicken. Oh my gosh. The butter chicken to take away. It comes to like £72. Yeah, I couldn't joke, believe it. it. I rung yeah. some member, I was like, you better be coming over later for this butter chicken. Yeah. What <laughs> like you buy from in Harrods. Yeah, and take, take away. away. Yeah. Like in the food hall. We need everything in there. Like, you know, a little piece of salmon's like 70 quid. I know. I'm it's like... crazy. But yeah, the cost would be <clears throat> not surely, you like have to live like that, but yeah, just... surely, like the waitrose, even and like, all of that, Marks is. I, I think would it's all be. more expensive. Yeah, but it would be lovely. I mean, you you would love to do that. I'm not really that fast. No, I like con- I like country. Cut, so do I, when do you know life. when even when I do go out to the countryside, like to anywhere. Yeah. obviously we've got quite a lot of countryside near where we live as well. I do love it. I do say that to mm. you as well. I would like to live somewhere a bit further it's out. Nice in the country. Not like completely out, but apart from you can't keep your cars clean. No, but I like to go <laughs> to walk. I like to yeah, walk. See, I like Greg, to walk to the station. Greg like goes. I'm not living yeah. in the street with no street lights. But I suppose I've got in London, so it's a bit different. Yeah, it's it, different. So. It's very different. It's mm. like, but I think like there's different stages of your life for different like, Reasons, like yeah. you're saying when the yeah. kids are all older. When we're all grandparents, we can do whatever we want. You yeah. know what I mean? Technically, we can actually live and do and travel. We've got, yeah. we've got ages to wait. <laughs> I hope yeah. a long, long way away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's a good one. Oddest place you've been recognised. I would say, right, this is quite recent as well, where I've been to America quite a lot recently. I've been in store, in one of the stores, and someone on the, like, like the cashier has recognised me and said that they've <coughs> watched all of our shows. American. Yeah, that's... Sometimes in America, they get these channels and they like British TV. Oh, we had a similar situation when we was in the Maldives. We went to Ayada. Remember there was an Australian girl that come up, might have been me and mum... And she came home, she was like, Some people really enjoy British TV. She was like, It's we don't like get to watch it, but we stream the series after. And and that was a similar situation. Like we think never in a million years. What about you? Mine was at a Wrexham Salford game. (laughs) (laughs) An old lady recognised me and everyone found it hilarious. So everyone always brings it up that was there that day. (laughs) Paul, where was you that time then them girls were chasing you? Was it an airport? Or? Everywhere. It happens all the time, Sam. He said, I was somewhere <laughs> and they were chasing me for a photo and they were jumping over, like, wasn't they jumping over those? Oh, yeah, where was that? I don't know. It must have been in, like, an airport. An airport. It was Security. An airport, yeah, it was an airport. Uh, and you rang me and you was like, they've literally, like, jumped over all these things to try and get to me. To oh, but that was the worst night. I feel like it was like Mallorca. I don't think it, it might have been Mallorca. I wasn't there. I think it was Mallorca. That's but really Magalufas. funny. Magalufas. <laughs> Magalufas. Um... Okay, so other question. Tips for a long-lasting relationship. Let's ask the boys. Come on. 
tips. Come on, lads. <clears throat> tips. <laughs> I would say you've got to play the game and be fair and try and pull your weight a little bit at home. I don't know. Take little things like bringing the tea up. That makes me really happy. It really makes us so happy. That's all yeah. I ever want, really. It makes really? me happy when you bed. eventually get out of bed. On the weekend. I'll be in my dressing <laughs> room, thank you. Yeah. Getting ready. You don't realise how much happy that make, happiness it brings yeah, to me. Yeah, just a cup of tea. Laying really? in bed, give me like oh, an extra no, 45 minutes. This, this is what? actually what I was telling mum this morning. So I got up early, I was in the shower, getting ready. You was actually snoring in bed. And um, Nelly come, Nelly always gets up really early. She's mm. like the first one awake in the house tinkering around anyway so she comes walking in the dressing room she's got a wooden chopping board with two little cups of tea on it and oh. and four biscuits right oh, I was like, bless oh, her oh nelly is that today today i went oh. out i went out first time she's ever done it mm. first time she ever done it. she's made oh, you're sorted now no but she's made the tea but, I, no, but, but you know like i was so no but i was so <laughs> grateful for it but and yeah. I, I was so happy but also I was like, how did you do the hot tap, Nelly? You, you know, like, yeah, you want to be grateful and happy, but, I, did, feet. but yeah. I didn't want her to imagine, but she went, no, mummy, I put the oven glove on, and then I'd done oh, the cups under her. the hot tap, and the tea was perfect. Like, no. perfect colour. It was in two little glass um, tea cups. It was the cutest yeah. thing, and she went, but and I said to mum, how she didn't spill, spill it coming it upstairs. Way, yeah. like, upstairs. Obviously, yeah. I didn't mention She'd that to her. She'd have a tray, though. No, she had a wooden yeah. chopping board, yeah. a small wooden, wooden chopping board. And then you go in the room, it was all like swinging around. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh that is so nice. Yeah, so I think cute, you're sorted out. Get her just, a bigger tray. But I was just worried about the more so the the, the tea on the, the hot tap. I went, she went, no, what I do is I put an yeah. oven glove on. That's really, and then really, I really smart. really thought about it, yeah. Isn't yeah. it? It's really, my job. What am I going to do now? You no, know, she's realised you don't do it for me as much anymore. So, yeah, I thought well, that was ne quite Next cute. time I'm round yours, I bet she'll make us both one. Yeah, she'll make us a tea. I thought that was really cute. That is really sweet. Yeah, you're sorted now then. Yeah. Tea in tea, bed. Yeah. Um, is there any parenting that you disagree on? Yeah. We disagree on boundaries. What do you mean? So we like, so we'll, one of us will make a rule. No TVs tonight. The other one might, like, we might not have communicated about that. And then like, I'll go tootling in, in the room like, well, what do you want to watch on Netflix? And then like, and then it's like, what, like not often. No, or, or you give not, in. Or, or, or one yeah. gives in and the other one, mm. like, I, I'll maybe see like more, I feel sorry for them more and Greg will go, no, no, we've got to see. I think that's something that we clash on sometimes, mm. isn't it? And like, you know, like you've got to be 100%, haven't you? We're both in it together. Yeah. Yeah, we do that often. Sometimes I'm always, we, I'm yeah. a bit of a pushover, aren't I? I would say, so I, I. I'll say, not getting that, not doing it. I'm not doing that again today. But yeah, like, and oh, if you don't go through with it, they just this they, is what they think you're never gonna. They just think, oh yeah, all right. So you today, I mean? next thing you know, she's down Tesco's buying toys. Buying yeah, it. well, this is what happened re this week. So Paul has got this charity day at school today. All the classrooms are doing like games or whatever. Children can spend money on the stalls. They've asked all the kids to bring in four small toys each. So then that will be the prizes they give or whatever mm. so we give them they buy the toys and they sell them for charity or whatever it is yeah so i've just gone on to ebay and bought a box of like took really mm -hmm. but that's all they wanted they wanted key rings pencils yeah, rubbers it's like you know little things so i thought it's cheaper easier and i just thought i was being organized anyway it's arrived paul basically had a meltdown saying that he wanted to choose them he didn't want that send Aww. it back <laughs> Do you know, you just like it was perfect as well. Yeah, like, like you thought like, he was ahead of the little game. Little Tom Bowler, like, really bit good. Of something, you know. Anyway, um, we sort of left it, left it, left it, and then he was still going on about it. So I thought he'd forget about it and just take it in. Oh, anyway, no, yesterday, he's yeah. So last night was today's the last day. So yesterday, he's ringing me. What are you doing? I went on my way to Tesco. What for? <laughs> to buy the four toys for Paul. Give in. I give in. Yeah. But you know, like sometimes you just you know what it is. Sometimes. Those little things, right, might not seem anything to yeah, us, but to them... It's a really big deal. It can be, yeah. like, something they feel really, like, proud of bringing in and they picked it and they... And that's what I think I say to Greg sometimes. We have to remember yeah. they're just kids. Yeah. They're little... In their little heads, they just don't... Can't work it out. Something, you know, like... Yeah. You feel... It's, it's hard, isn't it? Well, it was, like, Parenting this morning... Parenting Yeah, this morning, non-uniform day. What was it called? Um, Mufti. 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 Mufti day. So, he, you know, he's got, like, maybe five tracksuits laid out in the bed. Yeah. Yeah. And they're all sort of similar colours. They all kind of look the same. And it went on for ages. Yeah, it? but he's get it's raining today. Yeah, it weren't very nice. It, we, they he's left got to so the stage late. now where he's like, I don't, I like that tracksuit. I don't want to get it dirty. So he's oh, now conscious yeah. of like he's nice. But and no, stuff, but we so. had like this 
Like, it wasn't like pure crying, but it was just... For, oh, oh, right. I went, in, I went into worst, Paul and it? I went, Paul, Nearly don't just. like lose it or anything because he's obviously really tired. I went, but I've done half an hour now. Yeah. You're going to have to go in and speak to him as a dad and yeah. sort out this outfit situation because yeah. I can't do any more. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to explode. <laughs> Oh, and they don't. do push you to that point. I, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. You just yeah. want to go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they, yeah. And when they fight, it's well, so hard. And, and and also the mornings, the mornings yeah. are the hardest because you'll need to be out the door. And you and also like I say, so it's stressful. Quick, when they when they're stressing me out in the mornings, it it makes me feel anxious that for the day, and I feel like uneasy. You know, like when they yeah. leave the house and it's all been really stressful. Yeah. I, 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 I don't say recall Craig, being like that. No. I don't remember that. No. Yeah, we no. don't. I, I don't think. think I remember, we like, just used thinking, to get ready. I used to drive my mum and mad. Like no. No, we, we have. We have some real our... scenarios in our house. So do we. So do we. Where it's no, but I said no, but out of, like between us and our close friends, I'm the only mum of an actual toddler, baby. Mm. That third child in the mix yeah. makes yeah. all That's the difference. Yeah, right. Oh, massive. So yeah. Margo's come. Yeah. When I explain like our mornings, they sort of laugh like like what are you talking about? But I'm like, you don't realise what it's like yeah, with the third child in the mix. It is kind of grow out of it. It must grow out of it, mustn't they? Yeah. So. It's all going on. Edward's sitting there throwing porridge everywhere. And, you know, oh, nice. He's going to have to clean all this up after as well. It's, it's, like, it's yeah, it's, it's a battle in the mornings, isn't it? And like, no. and then you've got like we roses in swinging war. in the like bath. Like, like, you know, if Arthur yeah. kicks off, that's it. You're you're, you're done. <laughs> <laughs> no, and it's yeah. just, it's just, you know, it's, Nelly, it's you it sets the Nelly. tone for the day sometimes. Like, yeah. It really Nelly. gets to me sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes I switch off and get on with it. Sometimes I feel all like, yeah. Oh, like all like, just annoyed with how the morning went because I think it's so unnecessary. Yeah. Over what? I'm like, over how did what? They even start? Yeah. Anyway, we've gone completely off here. Yeah. Um, should we do one last question? Yeah, let's do one right, last okay. question. Okay. So this is a good one. Right. <laughs> Find it. Okay. Who would last longer looking after all six kids on their own? <gasps> Sam, Billy, Paul or Greg? I'm going to throw it out there and say Greg. Greg. I'm, I think Greg. Because <laughs> Greg can just Greg, really like, just, yeah, lets them all it's kind like of... being on holiday with Greg. He can't keep still, so he takes the kids all Basically, up to go, like, be yeah. kids bike riding or yeah. camel riding. Yeah. Or, he's always doing I'm, something. Yeah. yeah, like, I think I think probably you, because you're quite... Children's entertainer. Yeah, you're quite... And you're quite chilled out. You don't really, like, get... I mean, obviously, like no, behaving. Do, no, do you do it. get, you do. But I think when it's like all of them together, you're you don't seem to be. Yeah, he's, like like he's like the fun it. guy, isn't he? I yeah. think Greg's yeah. had. I think you've had. Four he's had all four of them before, before, but he hasn't had Edward and Margot as well. You've done things like taking the four yeah, of them up, up the high street. street yeah. yeah, but I think Greg doesn't overthink anything. He just thinks, oh yeah, let's just do yeah. it. Let's just do it, like go. And that's probably better when you if you had six kids maybe we should try do you want to try it <laughs> should I we try it work out with the little ones that's the jesse's thinking yes please no, 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 no. <laughs> no. it's not fair on two babies though it's, it's two babies it's edward and margo it's only edward and margo also keeping edward away from margo <laughs> <laughs> poor yeah. margo that's the only thing you have to have eyes in the back of your head with their yeah, ages when they get to that certain age just yeah they just get on with it i feel like edward's, have to stop and edward's them getting really good recently in terms of going off and playing yeah he is yeah it's getting a bit better how old is edward now uh, 20 months. 20 months. Be two, 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 yeah. yeah. I wonder which one of us would be the worst at looking after all six kids. Uh, probably not, not because you couldn't do it, but probably yeah, you, yeah. Paul. What, most impatient? Yeah, well, no, not impatient. I think you could do it, but Paul's too, like, you, like, you know, you mentioned then about the porridge. Paul can't deal with, like, mess. the yeah. mess. Mm. I like everything to go perfect, like you just yeah. said there. If yeah. it don't go in the morning how it's you want it, yeah. it plays on your Make, mind all yeah. day. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I'm more like, <laughs> yeah, I'm like, forget the porridge. And then if it's all, I give him a big hug and a kiss at the school no, but she'll like yeah. put, put yeah. Edward in the chair yeah. and give him his porridge. So then you've got all that mess. And then but I'll just be thinking in my head, Lena the cleaner a bit so <laughs> you were worried about that yeah exactly <laughs> I don't know you were the porridge <laughs> Catherine will be in soon <laughs> yeah I'll be like I'm not worried no, but he's, he does though and then he'll and that's what I'm saying then he'll find himself cleaning up whatever the mess is and I'm like just leave that they all need to get out the door for school yeah yeah like you're, you're stressing I, over something I, I stress about things like that yeah. sometimes I know like I'm I like don't. remember the morning we was going to Lapland. Greg, we, it was 15 minutes before we was walking out the door. Greg started cooking a massive fry out. <laughs> 15 minutes before we were meant to be leaving. And I'm like, but we've got to go. And then there was mess everywhere in the kitchen. I was really agged out. You know, like, it wasn't just eggs. It was like sausages, bacon. It was like the full shabam. Um, things like that would, yeah. Yeah, I've been at your house before. And, like, everyone's ready to go out and do something. Can you're smoking something up in the kitchen. And Brittany's <laughs> like, what are you doing? Where was we going? I think, like, maybe... 
Libby's wedding or something. I can't I'm remember what it was. I, I, and you cook, like, I do the breakfast, don't I? That's yeah, but the mess. Yeah. yeah. That was great, well, guys. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks for joining us. You're welcome. What are you, yeah. what are you two up, off to now? I've actually got a meeting. I've emailed you my invoice for today. <laughs> <laughs> you're going, back, you're going, yeah, going to, to work. work yeah. I've got to go and meet Xanthi. Also, for the listeners, we haven't got time to do our recommendations this week, but keep them coming in because I've actually started a list on my phone, have you? So, like, next week... No, but I need oh, to. I have. <laughs> I need to, yeah. So, sorry. next week, we'll do the Oh, actually, sorry, episode. no, I have. You sorry. could recommend your viewers to keep your husband or boyfriend happy on Valentine's night. Uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, no, I've got a few. This is more about products. Oh, right, this is well, products. Yes. Oh, well, I'm talking about services. <laughs> oh my gosh! Lower the tone. Services. What, anyway, what, what, they want you to recommend them like a. Yeah, they so we're going to chat about. Yes, or, we're going to yeah. talk about like you know products that we've used throughout the week or things that we think or, or someone we've been, been or something like we've done or, or something, whatever it might be. I've actually got some really good ones to talk about. We'll do it next week. Okay, thanks. Bye. Bye. <laughs>